Hi everyone, I'm Kaylee Crane, I'm a freshman, and I am vlogging our closing performance of Once Upon a Mattress. Woo! So I'm yeah. currently I'm currently in the dressing room with Natalie Skelly, so Kaylee McAlonin, Vivian Lehman, and Bridget McNamara. <laughs> And I'm just gonna show you all the behind the scenes stuff for our last show of Once Upon a Mattress. Tonight is a big performance and it's our last one, but yeah. it's extra important because yeah. there's also Cappies, yeah. which is like this award ceremony that's like in the Philadelphia area kind of thing. And a bunch of schools participate participate in it. So we have Cassie, Cassie, Cassie is a Cappy. Why is it Cassie upside down? Cappy. I don't know. Do it's not upside down. I promise it's not upside down. It just looks upside down. Why should we be filming upside down? I'm not filming upside down, Bridget. Mm -hmm. I'm not filming upside and down. And basically, Arch Music, it's an award ceremony for musical, <laughs> and we actually think we have like a good shot to win this year, which is yeah. exciting. Because Arch Music only won like three-ish Cappies, I think. But they've been nominated for dozens, so fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Yeah. Who's ready for mic check? I wonder if you guys should Not go with me. Me, because I have a mic. My mic's always wrong. So. Oh, am I on camera? Is this a Hi, ball? I'm Meredith. Tell us what you do in the show, Meredith. I'm on stage crew. Nice. Hi, I'm Maya. Um, Meredith is a sussy baka. No, I'm not. And um, I'm your mom. Maya? No, go back uh, to Maya. Maya. You're a mime princess. <laughs> Maya, try again. Maya, Maya is a mime princess. Can you I'm the Luke. Ball? I'm a mime yeah. prince. Uh, okay. Hi, I'm Jack. I'm the wizard. Hi, I'm Kate. I do spotlight. I move walls. Yeah. Jack. are you excited for Cappy's night? Yeah, not in these pants though. Yeah. Hi, this is our music director. And right here, there's a nice draft coming in, and I'll be dry in no time. You have now reached the seventh plateau, and here is your final question. It's divided. Thank you. Thank you. So I've just been, I've been saying people's schedules for my mic check, every mic check, but now I've kind of run out of people's schedules I know. Say mine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> We are now going to make sure all my props are in order. I have to get my little um, mattress for the beginning. Hi, Neve. Hi. This is our hallway. This is our hallway. That we have to walk through to get places to cross to the other side of the stage. A few minutes until vocal warm ups, and I am now curling my hair with a straightening iron. Sure, I'm Miley Gucci and I am playing a person, well, the Nightingale of Samarkand, and basically a lady who thinks I'm a bird. Nice. I am Cassie Madalonis and I'm playing Lady Lucille, who is a dress obsessed Prissy Princess. Well, can we see your dress if your character says dress obsessed? This one? This one? How about we show off this pretty print over here? Oh, yeah. All done by our amazing costumer Ray. Yeah. So I was like, if Hi. Our I felt costume. the wrong eye, and I was like, am I just like going crazy? Would you like to introduce yourself and tell us your role in the show? Hi, um, I'm Ray. Um, I play the minstrel in the show. As they said, I also do all the costuming, mm -hmm. which is how many costumes? Um, I'm basically all the narrator. Just in case people are always like, what's your role? I'm the narrator. Nice. Yeah. I'm expository. And Kaylee, what do you do? Hmm? Uh, I'm in so No, say your line. She's mine. There you go. That line got a lot of applause yesterday. Yes, it we had gay it's people. We had gay people in the audience, so yeah. On our way to the choir room for vocal warm-ups. Yes. Yeah. Sorry. Yes. Yeah. Hi, I'm Emily, and I play Princess Number Twelve. Hi, I'm Emily Reed, and I play Princess Number Twelve. And I'm a senior at Archmere, and this is my last show, and I'm very upset about it. Not really. 
and have to act with Ray again. I can't get this. It's either Spanish Panic or Soft Shoe. I forgot the name for a second, um, which is bad because I'm in that. Um, but yeah. What's your favorite musical number? Uh, I guess Normandy, unfortunately. Yeah. It's grown on me. I did, you're right, but then I actually got good at it and was like, oh, I know what I'm doing. So. We're all really excited. Yeah, we are. Cappies are here. Yeah, they are. Oh boy. There's like almost 300 people in the audience. It's gonna be a fun show. What did you say? Maya, what's your favorite memory from this show? Um, like just like having backstage time, like during like the shows. It's like fun to be like backstage during while the show's happening. You can look at what like like watch like from the side. Yeah. What's your favorite memory? Oh, I don't know. There's so much to say. Um, yeah, I actually don't know. The dance numbers are fun. The dance numbers are really fun, yeah. Could you two do the Spanish Panic right now? No. Definitely. Okay. I want to do it. <laughs> yeah. So, my favorite memory of the show was either, um, when Kate, uh, when Kaylee's mom, like Kaylee emailed us saying, "B2 Dubs, here's a billboard that you can use," and then I got to design it. And when I finished that and I showed it to Mr. Man, I think that was one of my favorite memories from the show. And Kaylee Macalona was sitting right next to me, and um, she was like, "I think you should raise that up like a little bit," and like I don't know, that just is the first one that came to mind. Um. Probably when Mr. Man went on like a 10 minute rant about how I'm the best pop props person. Also, um, all of the like Saturday rehearsals and like the little bits of time that I've got to spend with certain people, like car rides with Rob, all that stuff. I don't know. <laughs> we just, we just did the opening number. It's really fun. I like forgot to say on here that we even started the show, but we did many moons ago and opening for a princess, and it was so fun. Jake and Amanda are about to do In a Little While. I might show a little bit of that from the wings. for shy soon. That's Winifred's big entrance number. I just did shy and some wenchy stuff in the minstrel the jester and I, and now I'm getting water before Swamps of Home. You're not in Swamps of This is my cue sheet. It's a little outdated because I made it before all the dress rehearsals, but it's been very helpful. We just did Swamps of Home, and this is my last time checking in with you before intermission because I do Spanish Panic 1, which is like the scene before Spanish Panic, and then I am in the tent for most of the rest of the first act, and then we have Spanish Panic and Song of Love. Alicia is here! Mock Trial got second oh, yeah. nice! Oh. 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 oh, and then it's upside down. It's upside down. Yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. Act 1 was so fun. Oh my god, Act 1 looks so good. I got to watch the end of it in the audience. It was so good. They're doing amazing. I also, I also know this. Nope. What is your favorite part 
I gotta tell you, I literally love Song of Love. I, well, two. I also like Very Soft Shoes. So fun. The energy. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know. I like a lot of it. Miley wants me to say Nightingale, and Miley's song is a bop. Like, that is like, what's the word I'm looking for? Nighttime song. Lullaby. Lullaby. That's a lullaby. Because it's called the Nightingale Lullaby, right? It's a lullaby, and it's a good one. Happily Ever After, though, is so good. Serena sings that beautifully in, like, the best way possible. Um, but honestly, I hate dancing, but Spanish Panic might be one of my favorite numbers. Hi, my name is Sadie, and I play the queen! Yes, I am Sadie. I play Queen Agravane, and it's going well. It's intermission. I think it's going really well, but now it's quiet. Quiet is interesting. Quiet! She's got her 20 mattresses, the socks, and the best, and she's threatened execution if you dare disturb the rest yeah, of her okay. very special guest. You should copy her, word for word. Yeah. Ask you to perform your song as a monologue. Quiet. Quiet. I'm done. That's all you get at me. We just did quiet, and um, now it's the scene before Happily Ever After, which I will show you some of from the wings. And then um, after that, I have a lot of scene changes. Okay, you do that. scene changes and then the next number I'm in is very soft shoes but man to man talk is next now Just did our last soft shoes. I'm crying. So We have one scene before we go on for the finale, and then you won't really see us again until after the show. I'm gonna get some footage from the wings now. Bring the poppy mandragora incense. are crying that was very fun that was great 
we're going to strike the set now. We're currently cleaning up and striking the set and putting costumes away. And then after we're done this, we're going to go to the, the cast party. Tonight, this is why he deserves it. Mr. Man will tell us to take him down. He deserves it. He'll do it himself. For now, let people admire the hang. Bro, we are hanging a goddamn chicken. It's the 20th century. <laughs> this is actually the 21st yeah. century. It's even better. We are acting like it's the 20th century. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! We're hanging chickens, baby! We're hanging we just finished up um, cleaning and putting stuff away, and I went to the dumpster and had to throw a bunch of bags and boxes into the dumpster, and I got some mysterious liquid on me, which was not fun. See you guys in the next vlog. Subscribe, like, whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. See you guys for the next show or whenever I upload the New York video, whenever that may be. Yeah. All right, bye. Bye.